Okay, today we have a few things. We have one thing I'm not too confident about, but um, this card chase. They call it the um, world's greatest card chase, one of those. And I've got two of these um, packs here. It's four packs in a sealed um, bag, if you will. It says three tops chrome update series packs plus two exclusive pink refractor cards. So I guess that means six total tops chrome update packs and then four pink refractors. So, and it says, I think it said, you know, look out for Tatis and a few others. So let's start with one of the uh, tops chrome multi packs. I got these at Target. These go for, I think it was like $9.99 for these. We'll do these last. Let's start with the packs. I don't know if I've ever opened these. So. Michael Chavez, rookie debut. That's a, I mean, it's, these cards are nice. Okay, Mike Yastrzemski. I think it's the grandson of Carl Yastrzemski. Not numbered, or you know, not serial numbered. Sean Anderson, that's not numbered. And a Clayton Kershaw, greatest players. He's a great regular season pitcher. I wanna say I, re I heard somewhere that he grew up with um, Aaron Rodgers. Riley Austin. Not numbered. Riley Austin. Nate Lowe. Just a regular base card. Edwin Encarnacion. There's a Yankee. Okay. Anytime we get a Yankee, that's good. And Tony Gwynn, Family Business. Okay. I was sad when I heard that he passed away. He was one of those great hitters of the game. So, so far pretty underwhelming. Michael Brantley. All-star game card. Okay. Trevor Story. Just a regular card. Johnny Bench, one of the great ones. And Iron Man, Cal Ripken Jr. So, uh, I'm not the most familiar with all the different baseball cards, all the best players, but I didn't see anything in there that was at all spectacular. Let's see what we get here. Dallas Cutchell. That's a, uh, I guess, what is that, pink reflector? Refractor. Okay. And Spencer Turnbull. Okay. A rookie card. Let's do the... World's Greatest Card Chase. Let's see if there's anything notable in there. I've heard that these are an absolute waste of money. Uh, so my hopes are not very high. But I figured for 20 bucks, let's just be silly and uh, take a chance. <laughs> okay. Is this, this 99? I don't see where it says what year this is, but this is Donruss Baseball. Yeah, this is 89. I can tell just by the card. Okay. So who knows? Maybe we'll get a Griffey Jr. Oh, it looks like Greg Maddox. That's a third year card. That's cool. These puzzle cards. Okay. Warren Spawn. Warren Spawn. Luis Polonia, Brad Wilman, okay. Ken Fellow, there's a Yankee. Okay, Mike Greenwell, yeah. Yeah, I think, what, yeah, these are 89. Yeah. Okay, nothing, nothing to write home about there, guys. Let's see what else we get. Don Russ, what year is this? I can't tell. 
Looks like 89 as well. So here's this, here's this. Could they be the same year? No, these are 90. Because uh, it's last year on, it's 89. So this should be 1990. Yeah, it says right there. Oh no, 89 leaf. Maybe the other one was, I don't know. Checklist, okay. Nothing too exciting. Kevin Mitchell, he was a good player. Dale Murphy. Tony Gwynn, speaking of which. That was his fifth year. Ken Smiley. Okay. Very underwhelming so far. 92 year baseball. Wow. Looks like a bunch of 50 cent packs so far. After I open this pack, I will look at all the remaining packs together and see if any of them look interesting. Uh, like I said, I don't have what Frank Sinatra would refer to as high hopes. Okay. The Indispensable, Carrick and Jr. and Joe Carter. Joe Carter, I think he went on. He's the one that became an announcer, I believe. Jack Morris. Okay. These are probably a bunch of throwaway cards. Don Sla Carlton Fisk, okay. Gary Carter, had a nice career. John Ramos. All right. So far, not too impressed, but we have 89 tops. The Babe Ruth collection. So these are obviously reprints. Another 89 tops. You can feel the piece of gum. Uh, opening day tops 2019. Don Russ baseball. Probably says somewhere what year it is. I just don't see it. Oh, 90 score. <laughs> Takes me back. 88 Flare Baseball. Sport Flicks. I used to love these cards. 87 Sport Flicks. And then 91 score. So, none of the redemptions, as you might expect. So, probably a complete waste of money, as I thought when I bought it. But that's okay. Like Jets, you got Harris. Plant here, Jose Offerman. Ozzy can sink go. What? Seriously? Ozzy can sink go? I, I don't remember him going by Ozzy. Did he used to go by Ozzy? I don't know. Was that Jose's brother? Okay, his twin brother is Jose. Okay, that makes sense. I guess I didn't realize that Jose Cancinco had a brother that played in the major leagues. There's the, okay. Jesse Barfield, Yankee. Okay. I'm gonna open the sport flicks just because I always like the look of those cards. I don't think any of them really had any value, but I always thought they were fun to look at. I think those are the ones that kind of, like a 3D, I remember. Exclusive collector offer. Yeah. And there's those. All right. So can you guys, can you see that? That doesn't pick up on the camera as much, does it? Does it? Yeah, I guess it does. Okay. And that's Eric Davis. I still think it's pretty cool. Bob Forsh and Greg Harris. I just think those are cool cards. Opening day 2019. Let's see if we have anything good here. I doubt it. Okay, Anthony Rizzo. Mitch Hanniger. Raphael Devers. Nolan Ryan. Trevor Bauer. Kevin Gossman, okay. I'm pretty sure none of these are numbered or anything. No. Bum, bum, bum. What do we have here? The Babe Ruth stuff. Now, Babe is probably my favorite. Uh, 
Yeah, I mean, a lot of people like Mickey Mantle. I always liked the Babe. And I liked uh, Ty Cobb, too. I wonder if I just mentioned that these are all reprints. Yeah, 92. That's cool pictures, I guess. First home run in Yankee Stadium in 1923. The Bambino. Only back then could a fat guy be the best player in baseball. 1990 score baseball. Dave Martinez, Joe Bradley. See, I feel like Ben McDonald was a player back in this time frame where he had a rookie card. But everyone was thinking he's going to be great, and he ended up not really having much of a career, if I remember correctly. Ken Griffey Sr. Okay. Well, what is this here? This is Domino's Baseball. Likely not going to have Jack or the other part. Frank White. Steve you Ruben Sierra. Okay, Tim Wallen. Let me fill it. Bo Jackson. Second year Bo Jackson card. That's fun. Franklin Stubbs. There's my Donnie baseball. Yeah. Dwight Evans. Uh, Ken Gerhardt. Harold Baines, announcer. All right, then we have two packs of tops, 89 baseball. That opened awfully easy. I almost wonder if these are opened and, and repacked. I don't remember tops back then having cards upside down. So maybe I just don't remember, but it feels like these were repacked. I don't want to say and, you know, be wrong, but it feels like that's what happened here. Yeah, these are all underperforming. Last chance for anything redeeming. I'm not too hopeful. Craig Harris, Chris Carpenter. Larry Anderson, yeah, Danny Cox, Willie Frazier, Carmen Castillo, Jim Leland. Okay, he's been around. Well, that was a complete waste of freaking money. But, oh wait, I forgot. 88 Flare Baseball. Star stickers. Yeah, that opened so easily. I don't know if maybe the wax just deteriorated, but... Right. I really wonder if these were open and repacked. Oh. Okay. Alvin Davis, Terry Templeton, Dave Winfield, Sid Bream, Frank Viola. Bunch of garbage. Okay. Well, let's see if the Top Scrum can redeem this, this video. Last little multi-pack here of Topps Chrome. Let me get a Tatis or Jimenez or, oh, maybe a Guerrero. That'd be nice. I'm opening the refractors first here. Jonathan Shoup and, oh yeah, Seal Puig. Yeah, that might have excited me five years ago. You know, these are numbered. Okay. Now let's open the packs. I changed it up a little bit there. Oh, we got a Cecil Fielder at the back. Wilson Contreras, all-star game. Riley Austin, rookie. His rookie deb debut, one for three with a home run. Wow. So I have to look. I'm not that familiar with him, but here's a Jeter. And a Cecil Fielder. So I'm not that familiar with Riley Austin, but I'm going to look him up because I feel like I've heard his name some. Oh, yes. 
Zach Britton, New York Yankee pitcher. Hunter Pence. Ryan Reynolds. And a Vladimir Guerrero. Well, that's pretty cool. Yep. I didn't know Vlad's, Vlad's older brother, Wilton, played for the Dodgers. And they were teammates in the Expos in 99 and 2000. Okay. And his son's a heck of a ball player, as most of you probably know. Vlad Jr. There we go. That's a good one. Jimenez. Rookie debut. 0 for 3 with one run, an RBI, and hit by pitch. So I feel like that's a good card. Lucas Golito. I got none of these are numbered. Kerry Blackman and a Teddy Williams. So, like I said, I don't know what the value of, of the ones that I would consider the, the good pulls from, uh, from today's video would be the Riley Austin. Uh, Rookie debut and the Eloy Jimenez rookie debut. Now, does the rookie debut card make it less collectible? I don't know, but I'm gonna see. But uh, you know, these are good players, so not too bad. Let me know what you guys think. Did you get any of these at Target? Again, the the Topps Chrome three packs plus the two pink refractors were, I think, nine ninety nine a piece. So. Let me know if you guys got any, if you got any good pulls. Thanks. And by the way, I would not buy this garbage.